hello in this video today we are going to see couple of options available on ESXi console let's log in we need to press F2 to log into the console So this is the console where we can troubleshoot, we can configure SXI box. So the first option is to configure password. Like uh, this is like we can reset the password here if you if you remember the previous password. And the lockdown mode is to disable uh, like to prevent the users from logging directly to this host. Configure management network is used to configure network card as well as VLAN, IPv4, IPv6, DNS, etc. So we can we can select multiple NICs here based on VLAN. Like we can configure management network here from here. <coughs> We will be giving the VLAN ID here, so it's not mandatory, it's an optional. IPv4 is to configure IP address, uh, like we have option to ena enable DHCP as well as static IP and recommended is static. Okay, let me show you new thing, maybe a couple of people aware of this. We can access the same console from SSH, like from Putty. Let's try that. So, we logged in. So, sometimes uh, if uh, if, if we don't have a DRAC or ILO access and we want to reboot the server, we can do it from here too. And we can uh, we can restart VPXA or host D services from here. So we can access DCUA, direct access, access user control from here by simply typing DCUI here. You will be able to see the console here. And we need to give the password to log into this. You can see the same DCVA from here. Whatever we can do it on a console, we can do it directly from here. We can like whatever option we, we require we can do like we can restart a, a management network we can test management network we can configure management network so network restore options what it will do is it will restore the all network uh, uh, settings to default The main thing which is helpful is troubleshooting part like whenever we need to troubleshoot you can do it like enabling ESXi shell or SSH or like some other things like uh, if sometimes uh, VP sometimes host D is, uh, is not responding we can restart the management agent from here and even we can we can use the command to restart the host D service. So it comes to troubleshooting sometimes we need to view the logs where uh, like sometimes when system like ESXA box is uh, ESX box behavior is abnormal 
we can check the logs here so that we can trace the uh, we can trace the issue here couple of times it is very much useful so these are the logs available like syslog vm kernel log management agent log and uh, virtual center log so these are very much helpful when you are doing any troubleshooting and <clears throat> so this will give the details like uh, what are the like more is it an evaluation cookie or license serial number everything and reset, is, reset system configuration is nothing but restoring the entire system to default so that every settings will be cleared and reset to uh, to the fresh installation same thing whatever is available in a console we can do it from here see That's all about ESXi console. Thanks for watching. I hope this is informative. Thank you.